How to order Corbin Ruswin Mortise Locks. Corbin Ruswin Mortise Locks are ideal for high traffic environments, such as offices, schools, and hospitals. They are available in multiple finishes and with more than 50 functions and trim styles. In this video, we'll step through how to place an order for the ML2000 Series Mortise Lock Set. When you submit an accurate order with all necessary options, your order can be processed without delays to help ensure your project stays on schedule. We'll start by entering the number of locks needed. For this example, we'll order 24 locks. Then we'll choose the series and function needed for the locks, all of which can be found in the product catalog. In this case, we're ordering a classroom function, so we'll enter ML20 for the series number and 55 for the function. So we'll enter ML2055 here. Next, choose the trim, which encompasses the lever and rows or lever and escutcheon design. In this example, we will choose the Lustra style with wrought lever and wrought rows. So we'll enter L for Lustra, W for the wrought lever, and A for the wrought rows, LWA. You'll find a complete list of trim options in the product catalog. Next, choose the finish of the locks. Different finishes allow you to customize your space. For this project, we like the satin chrome finish, so we'll specify 626. The hand determines the direction the door swings to open when standing on the secure side of the opening. LH stands for left hand and RH stands for right hand. LHR and RHR stand for reverse options. You may want to select an optional strike for your doors. Locks in this series come standard with strikes that have an ANSI straight lip and measure one and an eighth inches from lip to center. Our sample project requires two inch curved lip strikes, so we'll enter SA200 right here. Next, choose any additional options needed for your locks. In this example, we'll select the ANSI wrought strike box and the non-ferrous lock case so we'll specify M17 and M26 for these options. For a list of all available options, consult the product catalog. Next, we'll specify cylinder and keying options. The ML2000 series lock comes standard with a conventional six-pin cylinder. But since our project example requires a seven-pin cylinder, we'll enter the specification code for that option, 7P, here. We can also choose any additional cylinder and keying options. When ordering Corbin Ruswin lock sets, you can choose between visual or concealed key control. With visual key control, the key symbol is stamped on the plug face of the cylinder. With concealed key control, the key symbol is stamped in a concealed location, such as the rear of the cylinder, so it's not visible to general occupants. We'll select visual key control cylinders only, so we'll enter VKC3 for this order parameter. Finally, if your project requires master keying, you must provide all information concerning the key system layout when you place your order. Each keyed lock will require a key set. The key set determines which keys in the master key system will operate the lock. In this example, we are setting up a four-level master key system and keying these locks to key set AA1. This means the lock will be operated by the change key AA1, the master key AA, the grand master key A, and the great grand master key, or GGM. For all available cylinder or keying options, refer to Corbin Ruswin's key systems catalog. That's it, your order is complete. By following these steps, your order will be processed immediately. Function, trim, finish, and hand are always required fields when ordering mortise locks. At Corbin Ruswin, we're committed to getting your order right the first time. And by ensuring your order string is completed correctly, you'll avoid delays in processing. Finally, to ensure accurate billing, remember to reference any quotes you have received.